Average Gamer Nerd. What is up, Average Gamer Nerd bringing you Korma. This is another free early access game on Steam. Uh, it's survival. Another survival game. Uh, basically reads, Abandoned on the island of Korma without any equipment is what you are. Collect whatever you can find in order to survive. You fight against Mother Nature. Build a shelter to protect yourself and most valuable items. Your goal is to be the strongest survivor and rule the island. Now, Steam reviews are about mixed, about 50-50 on that. Um, well, let's jump in and play. I was going to film some Veritex tonight, but unfortunately, uh, I still can't get any wood on that. <laughs> no pun intended. So, uh, without further ado, let's jump in and let's play some Korma. Play some single. Normal. Island of Korma is not a selectable option, so I guess we're going to be on the Isle del Nemo. I hmm, wonder if we're supposed to find him. We'll auto save to slot one. And, uh, alright, I think we're ready to rock and roll. Holy naked butt. <laughs> ah, that is hilarious. It's like we're 100 with food, 100 on water down here. Holy cow. Alright. Oh, we got some mud or something on our bootay. Let's see. Looks like we've got a hammer and some sort of... Is that a spear? What is this? Nope, it is a torch. So let's bring up our hammer here. Uh, temperature 5. So it's nice and toasty warm. Alright, let's let's uh, let's see what we can do here. Hammer this. Crouch. Nope. I still can't get over that guy's butt. Harvest bush. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Harvest some more bush. Alright, what else we got here? I guess we got some more bush. Let's keep collecting bush. Maybe we can get some clothes and cover our boote here. Alright, let's see. Can we hit this rock maybe? With the hammer, crouch, can we hit it? Oh, there we go. Stone. Alright, we're getting some stone. Awesome. Let's keep pounding away here until we can't get any more. That is it. Oh, nope. We can get more. I know one thing about these survival type games you get as much resources as you can. Help you out. Not sure what all these blocks down in the left hand corner are for, but um I'm sure we can figure it out. So we get going on the game a little bit. Harvest more bush, we got some more cloth. More bush. More We are auto saving a lot. Let's see, can we hit a tree with this and get wood? Say no. All right. Oh, well, there we go. I guess we just got to be right there in order to get the wood. A little bit off on the hitbox there, just a little bit. But we'll just keep pounding until we can't get anything else out of this tree. I don't see any of the boxes going up to signify if I have a weight restriction here. I can just keep hitting and keep hitting this tree. Watch my hammer strength down there. Alright, let's see. I auto saved again. Alright, hold on here. We're going to go in and work on this autosave issue here. Uh, it's in that slot. I don't see any autosave settings. Hmm, okay. Oh, oh well. Alright, let's, let's see what our crafting does here. Inventory? Nope. Tab. Alright, so we've got... Oh, we got some food. <laughs> 1,505 thirst an apple will give you. Alright, let's see what we can craft up. Let's see, metal pickaxe. 
It requires a crafting bench. All right, let's start out with tools. Let's see. Stone pickaxe. I wonder if we can do one of those. Yes, we can. We have... All right, so let's get that. And what about a stone axe? Yep, we can get both of those. Those are two important tools to have. And they are currently... Well, yep, crafting. All right, what is a hammer? Cost us 25 wood. Okay, well, so we're good on that for now. So we'll wait for that stuff to queue up. Maybe we'll go over here and try to hit another tree. There we go. We're just a little bit to the to the right of where you need to hit. All right, we got our stone pickaxe, so maybe we can hit some of these and get a little bit better. Uh, instead of getting one at a time, maybe we'll get more at a time here. So. All right. All right, let's get that stone pickaxe up and let's see what we can do. Pick up some more. Some more bush while we're at it here. And let's let's hit some rocks. At least we got a crouch. There, there we go. Yep, look at that. Seven, eight per hit. Ah, that's better. A lot better. Oh, wow, and they disappear too. Cool. I'm going to crawl around a little bit here. Does anybody else think I look like Smeagol a little bit when I crouch? Where's my precious? I need my precious. Oh, where is it? Yeah, yeah, definitely we got some Smeagol action going on there. I guess if the ears would be bigger, he'd be more like a Dobby, but, you know, hey. I wonder what's taken our axe so long to make. Awesome. This autosave thing is kind of driving me up a wall. I wonder how I uh, go about getting that off of there. Well, it looks like kind of a different rock than what we're normally hitting. Let's see if that gives us anything other than just stone. I guess that's a lot of stone. Alright. Okay, cool. Alright, we're going to have Smeagol running around here a little bit. Let's see what else we got here. Now that, I don't see. They kind of look different from afar, but apparently not. Let's get a couple more bush and see if we can get some clothes on his naked butt. i have to... I have to put a sticker over or something on this, because Lord knows YouTube will probably hit me with something. Right, we'll grab a couple more here. He moves pretty quick, too. It's almost like he's running. Alright, let's bring back up our crafting menu here and see what else we can do. Um, I want to know what happened to my uh, my axe. I know I made one, and it's not showing up. Let me go back to crafting. Let's see. Let's craft a stone axe. We'll craft it again. It says 25 seconds. Let's see what happens here. Skip out of the queue. Keep looking around here. It looks about the same as everything else. I wonder if you can hit a tree with a pickaxe and if it does anything for you. And it gives you two with the pickaxe. Which is a couple more than you normally get. Oh, oh, the stone axe is ready. Let's see how much of a difference we got with the stone axe versus... Look at that, ten. Oh yeah, much better. And the trees disappear now. Okay, so let's... Let's get some more wood. I know I said let's get his naked booty covered, but, um... Now, that seems to be hitting right on the money now with the axe, as opposed to the hammer. So... I say that, and then it's off by a little bit, but hey, alright. Who's counting? Alright, let's go back to our inventory, and let's see if we can get some clothes on this naked guy. Let's see how much pants cost us. Let's get some pants. Cloth 50. Yes, we can make those. We got enough. Of cloth. The only thing I don't like about this is it doesn't show your total number of the item that, that it costs. 
Yeah, it says it costs 50, but how much do I have without going back into my inventory scene, uh, screen? So, eh, it's all good. Just we're gonna have some pants now. Let's see, do we have enough for a shirt? Yep, we do. So we're gonna craft up a shirt. In the meantime, let's go to our inventory and let's get some clothes on our naked butt. Let's see, do we drag these over to here? Yes, we do. All right, now we have some pants. Oh yeah, we have 156 cloth. We got plenty. 100 rock or 100 stone. Well, about 188 stone and 58 wood. So we can gather some more wood. But at least now we're not going to be naked here. All right. Hey, all right. Hey, all right. Now we can. The sensors can leave us alone because we have some clothes. Hmm. Interesting. Come on, get on that tree. Come on, buddy. Come on, hit that tree. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. Let's walk up. There we go. That's, well, that was anticlimactic. Alright, let's we'll collect some more bush on our way. We're still okay on water and food for now. We've got plenty of stones. Wood is what we need right now. Eventually we're going to have to find some animals or something. Hey, I got another apple out of that tree, so that'll, that gives us 15 towards our hunger and 5 towards our thirst, so desperate times will be okay for stuff. Alright, need some more wood. There it goes again. Man, you missed that tree, and I'll tell you what. i tell you what. Let's see what else we need to do here. Hmm. I do apologize for that save screen, guys. I auto saving every two freaking seconds. Well, I mean, that may. I am just having a hell of a time here with this hitbox. Alright, let's just hit a different tree. That one is just not working out for us. Let's see, we'll approach this one and see what we can do. <laughs> there we go. Alright. We'll just we'll just stay right where we're at and we'll get this wood. Alright, looks I can't tell if it's coming night time, so we probably want to head towards the coast there and maybe start thinking about some sort of shelter. Alright, I think we've probably got enough wood to get us a basic shelter down. Um, I think this stuff respawns pretty pretty good. Oh, nope. Guess I can't grab that one. All right, got some more bush. I think out here, I think this is a good good place for us to build. It's pretty flat, pretty level, um, near a good water source. So yeah, let's uh, let's see what it takes to build. Ah, uh, crafting. Alright, house. Metal fence, metal, concrete box. What is this? Uh, let's go to all. I think, if I'm not mistaken, we have to have some sort of blueprint to build. Yep, five wood logs. Yep, used to construct buildings, so we have to have a blueprint. So we'll wait for that to queue up. Um, let's see, let's go to inventory. I think it's time to chomp on an apple. All right, that, that was that was tasty, very tasty. Not much uh, as far as inventory space goes. What is this here? Apple seeds. Okay. All right, so we can plant some apple trees. Cool. All right, let's uh, see where we're at. Okay, we got our blueprints down here, so we can hot bar to four, five. Sorry, can't count today. And let's see. We right click, left click. What? What are we doing here? Scroll. What? How do we use this? Hmm. Maybe do we have to have a hammer? Oh, and then left click. What is it? How do we how do we build some buildings here? Or now does this open up? Nope, it does not open up anything for our house. Let's see. Little fence, concrete blocks. 
Hmm. Well, let's at least get a campfire going. That looks a little messed up. Uh-oh. Technical difficulties here. We've lost our mouse. Interesting. Huh. Does that look like something up there on that ridge? Sure does. Looks like some sort of fort, maybe. All right, well, we'll wait for daybreak, and we'll go up there and check that out. But let's see. How do we How do we craft? Do we have to have it in our hand, and then... Can't seem to craft a campfire. All right, there. Campfire's crafting, so we can get some light here. I'm not quite sure how you. No. Uh -huh. Let's see, B for build. Maybe. Ah, interesting. Bring back up our inventory, and we'll put that bad boy down. All right. Interact with campfire. Contents. Well, let's throw some wood on the fire, shall we? All right. Oh. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We're gonna turn on the campfire. Turn on. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> contents. How about fuel, people? Yeah, there we go. Ah, there. Ah. I got it. I got it. Don't worry. Ooh, that's pretty. All right. Well, let's see if we can go back to figuring out this. Um, build thing here. How? Shift. Shift. No. Control. No. Maybe we can find something in the controls. Let's let's look really quick. I'll uh, promise you guys I won't make you watch this. So, all right. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm back here. Figured it out. You have to hit F. F, and that brings up our building uh, menu here. So, wooden floor. So I guess oh maybe that's what maybe you have to have a wooden foundation first. I don't know. I don't see it. And I got wood. Oh, there we go. I don't know. I don't know, people. I don't. I just, I don't get it. build here and hope for the best. Nice little wood foundation going here. Yeah, I think this might I think we're gonna go one more level out here. There we go. All right, we have we have a foundation, and we have two campfires. Okay, now well, let's bring it back up again, and let's let's get some walls. Yeah, I don't I don't know here. Not quite sure what was going on. I think we'll leave a space for a window there. Yeah, I think it's, that's good for a window. We'll put our door facing the ocean. Put another window right. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put a window there. Put a window out there. All right. Let's get our window. And of course, see what this place looks like at uh, during the day here. All right. And now we just need our door frame. Which will be right here. All 
right. Hey, all right. We've got four walls, folks. We have four walls, and we got some beautiful windows. <sighs> wow, that was uh, pretty amazing. Let's see. Let's work. This is probably going to be our ceiling tiles. Yep. So we can go ahead and get uh, covered up a little bit here. Out of the, out of the elements. I wonder why it won't let me build one there. Interesting. We might have to live with a skylight. That's interesting. It's not letting me build right there. I guess we're going to have to have a skylight. Awesome. Alright, we have ourselves a little bit of a safety base. Let's see. Foundation wooden stairs. Let's see. We'll build that up to our house here if we can. Awesome. Good. Now we got some little stairs that go up to our little domicile. Let's see. Let's get a door. Uh, yep. There we go. Wooden door. Awesome. All right. That is great. Now, I thought I saw something pretty neat here. A sign. Let's uh. Let's plot hole. Place to reserve the area around it for the owners. Cool. Window shutters and a wood ramp. All right. Well, let's 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 place our plot hole. If we can write any type of message on it. Keep out. Anyway. Pot hole. Build part. E. Add owner. Alright. I guess I'm added. Alright. I know it's hard to see, folks, but we got ourselves a nice little humble abode built. And I think this is a good place to stop and wrap it up for this episode. The next episode, I believe we are going to go venture up yonder, because it looks like there's a fort or something up there. It looks like there's some watchtowers up there and up there. So stay tuned for the next episode, and let's see what happens when we venture on, up on our way up to the fort. Thanks for watching, everybody, and enjoy the rest of your day.